I have been training in dance since I was three years old. I've been doing all styles and I've competed many times. And my style just kind of comes from my teachers. They have taught me everything I know and it kind of comes with the movement quality as well. The dream that brought me to the show would probably be just watching every single episode over and over again saying, I want to be exactly like them. And then finally being here, it's like, this is crazy. I don't even know what to do about it. Perfect. <laughs> what I like about dance most is that you can kind of, you can express any type of feeling at the moment through your dancing. And most people wouldn't know that, but dancers really can kind of convey a feeling or an emotion regardless of what style it is. And the best dancers can get that across to an audience and make the audience feel the same that they're feeling. My style is contemporary and I chose that style because that's probably the style that I'm best at. Um, I'm a well-rounded dancer so I can do just about any style but contemporary is definitely my strong point and it's the one that I feel most passionate about. Being in the top 20 means everything to me. I did not even expect to make it through my first audition, so going to Vegas was just mind-boggling. And then when they told me that I was in the top 20, I freaked out, and it still feels like a dream to me. I have been watching So You Think You Can Dance since season one, since when Nick Lazzarini won, and I'd say probably my biggest inspiration would be Melanie Moore, because she is amazing at everything. <laughs> the dream that brought me to the show would probably be just watching every single episode over and over again and saying, I want to be exactly like them. And then finally being here, it's like, this is crazy. I don't even know what to do about it. I think what really sets me apart from my competition would probably be that I'm a small town girl and I'm really laid back and I just, I like to have fun, but I really try to work hard at kind of adapting to whatever style they give me or try to just make it what the choreographer or the judges want. I guess my most memorable moment in this competition would probably be before I even got to Austin. I wasn't planning on auditioning because I thought I was too young to do it and I thought I wasn't experienced enough and so my mom told me that I had an open weekend that time and she's like you might as well try it and I'm like mom I don't I'm not gonna go far like don't make me do that and she didn't make me do it but she was like you might as well try it so I went and I've gotten this far so really all I can thank is my mom. <laughs>